Hi, I'm O.C. Farrell, and I'm a professor of marketing and Bill Daniels professor of business ethics here at the University of New Mexico Anderson School of Management. And I'm Linda Farrell, Bill Daniels professor of business ethics and professor of marketing here at the University of New Mexico. And we're looking forward to working with you this semester, particularly the large contingency to begin this semester from CU Colorado Springs. We've always had good interaction. This is a highly engaged experience. The good part, you can do this at your own pace. So you only have to post by the weekend and that gives you a chance to look at everybody else's posts and give some feedback on what other people are thinking too. So I'll turn it back over to OC for a few thoughts. <laughs> okay, the good thing about this certificate, and by the way, the difference between a certificate and a certification is that you will not be taking any test. A certificate simply means that you've gone through subject matter and have responded by uh, posting each week. And that's all that's required because we assume that most of you are instructors, professors, or business people who are really interested in the topic. So our goal is simply to make the material available and give you an educational experience. But you will get uh, a certificate from the University of New Mexico Management Development Center. And we look forward to every aspect of interaction. One of the advantages of this is that you don't have to meet at any time. You can do this at late at night or on the weekends, just so you post each week. So basically what we do is we provide you a roadmap, give you plenty of resources, and we're looking forward to your participation. So we're looking forward to working with you this semester, so thanks very much. And I think Linda is going to tell you a little bit about some things that will be coming up this semester, especially our workshop that's going to be in Santa Fe. I want to share a little bit with you about the uh, workshop that's included in your registration this semester. So we're going to have a teaching business ethics workshop. We partner with New Mexico State. The workshop will be held Thursday, May 2nd, Friday, May 3rd, starting at noon on Thursday, ending with lunch on Friday. So we'll have two fun-packed afternoon morning. We'll have a reception and a dinner on Thursday night as well. It'll be held at the Inn and Spa at Laredo in downtown Santa Fe, and we'll be sharing more on the program with you. We've got some great speakers lined up already. We've got Gretchen Winter, who's the uh, person running the Center for Business Ethics at the University of Illinois and we have other excellent speakers as well. So we think you'll enjoy that very much and we look forward to your attendance at that and we'll share more information. Again, all the costs associated with attending that workshop are included in your registration for the certificate course. Second, we're working with NASBA, the National Association of State Boards of Accountancy, on ethical leadership certification for students. We're beta testing it this semester. It's going to be six modules online. NASBA, which does the CEPA exams, will be doing the testing offering the certification, and again, as OC noted, the difference between certificate and certification, certificate is participation, certification means mastery of knowledge. So there will be testing after the, each module. Once students have completed all six modules and passed, they'll have NASBA, Student Center for the Public Trust, Ethical Leadership Certification. We think this is very powerful. It focuses on ethical leadership, communication, and how to manage others. So we'll be sharing more with you this semester about that as well. Thanks. And now I think OC is going to share a little bit of information with you about the Daniels Fund Ethics Initiative. The Daniels Fund Ethics Initiative here at the University of New Mexico helps make this certificate class possible, but also helps us to develop a wealth of resources to use in teaching business ethics. And I know we have many of our friends from the University of Colorado, Colorado Springs in this class as well as uh, some other schools that are in our area. But we're very, very uh, thankful that the Daniels Fund has been so supportive because this allows us to develop these teaching materials. Um, the schools, if you're interested, that are in the initiative includes uh, New Mexico State University, of course, University of New Mexico, uh, University of Colorado, Colorado Springs, University of Denver, uh, Colorado State University, University of Northern Colorado, University of Wyoming, and University of Utah. So we all have fairly large grants, and uh, we think we're kind of leaders in the area of business ethics. Which, in wrapping up, let me just say that business ethics has a long way to go in terms of being integrated into business schools, into the curriculum, 
into uh, specific subject matter classes in accounting and marketing and management. And part of our initiative in this certificate program is to equip you with more knowledge. And I can assure you that it's still debatable exactly how business ethics should be taught and the most effective uh, communication methods as well as subject matter. But we'll explore those things in this class. And we're really looking forward to your participation. That's very important. Uh, I'm always available if you want to email or call. Linda's available. And remember that Jan Morgan uh, is very helpful if you have any website issues during the entire class period. Thanks a lot, and we'll be back soon.